Um, India is one of the few countries where investment spending, I mean, it's in the midst of a capex revival. Mm. Uh, if you talk about infrastructure or any of the industries, including renewables, uh, there was a lot, of, a lot of investment going in by the government, um, you know, into real estate by the households, as well as private sector benefiting in, in certain sectors. Uh, so in this kind of, um, you know, at a time, many of the countries are certainly very keen to also participate in that investment revival. Uh, and I think Singapore has already, as Tanvi just mentioned, mm. very deeply clued into, uh, you know, as an FDI partner, as a trading partner, uh, it's very deeply clued into uh, the India landscape. Uh, so from that point of view, certainly I would think for both countries, you know, there could be a lot more private sector participation. Uh, I think there is already a significant investment, but certainly uh, much more could, can be built from there. And about four or five sectors that really come to mind, including advanced manufacturing, uh, where I think the synergies are very great. Precisely, and let's talk uh, in more detail about that, uh, Radhika, and Tanvir touched on this. How central will Singapore be in helping India move up the value chain and helping India realise its ambitions to become a global chip powerhouse? Uh, certainly, you know, um, India has uh, already, I think, not the least, the environment that we are in is it about supply chain reconfigurations, mm. right? So uh, in the past five, six years, there's been a lot of new fresh investments uh, by offshore entities who have been set up in, in India. There's been a, uh, a bit of reorientation away from China as well. So India certainly benefited from it. I think apart from just electronics, which is, uh, you know, handphone man mobile manufacturing, there's also this push to expand its semiconductor base. In fact, about five investment proposals have been approved on date. But, and, and some of that has also has some Singapore participation in, in it as well. And ASEAN being one of the first movers in this space, and, and Singapore in particular, very well known for its precision engineering, uh, advanced manufacturing space, can certainly play a very big, a very important role as a technology mm. partner. And that's precisely what India is looking for as well. Uh, so certainly, that I, is, I think, one a fertile ground for cooperation. And, and